Are you struggling to play against a spinner? Here is a video for you. First step longer to be fast in your feet. When to play this shot? After his release point. So you have to react after the release. Longer. For a spinner, this is my stance. One, two. One, two. Drive, come back. One, two. Drive, come back. One, two. Drive. Before going to the video, please subscribe and click the bell icon for more updates. Are you struggling to play against a spinner who is bowling continuously on the good length with a good loop and good turn? Here is a video for you. Once again, welcome back to Boys of Cricket Academy. This is Bulet. This video is about step out and drive. Let's go into the video. Basic key points to play a step out and drive. Number one, from your setup, always watch the ball. Number two, react after the release once the bowler release the ball you have to react for the ball number three your first step longer and second step shorter and quick number three your first step longer second step shorter and quick you have to be fast in your feet number four always stay with the ball with your shoulder stay with the ball and drive stay with the ball till the connecting point stay with the ball and drive when to play the shot so when a bowler is running into the crease, after his release point, step out and drive. So you have to react after the release. When to react for the step out and drive. If the bowler is running to the crease, after his release, step out and drive. When to react for a step out and drive. When the bowlers run up, ready? Watch the ball after the release, play. After the release, the first step longer, second step shorter to the ball, drive. Another key point is putting your shoulder to the ball when you are stepping out. When the ball is dipping, your shoulder must stay with the ball. Okay? Watch it. So, one, two, play. Let's see which length you can play a step out and drive. Okay? So, here for a spinner, this is my stance. Like the crease in the middle of my both the legs. Okay? So, this is my reach of drives. This ball I am going to drive. This length I can. This length. This length I can. Able to play a drive. The ball is in good length. That means a little bit far away from me. This is not in my reach. This length is not in my reach. But very very important. The ball must need a loop. Loop and the ball is landing there and going away or coming in. For a leg spinner, it's going to go away. For off spinner, it's going to come in. Okay? So, what you have to do is... First, first step should be longer. And the second step should be shorter. And play the drive. Okay? So, watch it. From your setup. Long step, short step. Drive. First step long, second step short, drive. And stay balanced. Yeah. First step long, second step short, drive. From your setup, from your setup, first step long, second step short, drive. Earlier I mentioned for step out and drive, when to react. I mentioned after the release, we have to react for the ball. Here is the drill. To develop your footwork. That means you have to react late. That time you have to react 
faster after the release you are stepping out you have to be very fast in your feet you have to be very fast in your feet and next thing you have to cover the line that means if the bowler is bowling loop and outside off stump you have to go to outside off stump if the bowler is bowling in stump line loop you have to go to stump line if the bowler is bowling leg stump line you have to go to stump line so here is the drill is helpful to develop your foot work speed and as also you your shoulder development also you can go to the line nicely okay watch this yeah here i am going three different lines one two drive come back one two drive come back one two drive to go to the line of the ball i am just getting my shoulder in line so step out and if the ball is bowling outside off stump i am getting my shoulder and getting the first step longer second step to the ball okay if i am going leg side putting my shoulder there first step longer second step step shorter watch it 1 2 back 2 back quickly 1 two. back quickly 1 2 in this drop ball drill i am going to focus on my shoulder to the ball because already i did in that cone drill i just focused on my footwork first step longer and second step shorter in this in this drill i am going to work on my shoulder with the ball my shoulder is going to with the ball okay once you start improve your step out and drive using the drop ball drill and the cone drills so next what you have to do is just add some challenge in your step out and drive drills here i'm what i'm going to do is i'm keeping a cone a different color cone in the off side and different color cone in the leg side so my partner going to feed the ball and he is going to call the color of the cone so i have to step out later and i have to pick the right direction of the ball okay let's see how i am going to execute that common mistake while playing this step out and try okay first one is before the next delivery predetermination yourself next ball i am going to play step out and drive predetermination so before before the bowler delivering the ball thinking yourself next ball i am going to play a step out and drive it's a big mistake not only step out and drive any shots you should not think next ball i have to play the shot next thing is not watching the ball before the bowler's release stepping out early step out if you step out early what will happen the bowler can easily find you and change the direction of the ball and there is lot of chance of stumping before the bowler's release stepping out is the big mistake and next thing is not staying with the ball so you, you will step out but what will happen you will stay away from the ball when you, you won't go to the line of the ball or you won't go to the pitch of the ball that's a big mistake again while playing this shot and the next big common mistake is like uh over hitting you will reach the ball nicely you will quick on your feet nicely but what you will do you will hit the ball harder that that also end up caught at covers or caught at long on or uh, caught at deep deep mid wicket like that okay so hope you like this video and you learned something from this video if you have any doubt comment below thank you for watching